each surgical reconstructive technique has its own set of issues. And I will be honest, to put an implant in the first part of a mastectomy is uncomfortable. It's a issue that is usually short-lived. A few weeks to maybe a month, it's, uh, the patient's uncomfortable. Then in the process through expansion, it, 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 again, it's like painting a portrait. It's like building a house or, or, or creating a statue. You just stretch the skin with the first stage of the implant reconstruction. That can be a little uncomfortable as well. But ultimately, women tolerate it, and they understand at the end the result and what we're trying to achieve is. The process where you take the stomach muscle or use the patient's own tissue also has its discomfort in the first few weeks or so after surgery as well. But usually all of these pain issues resolve over the course of about a month typically, and most patients go on to do really well after that. Uh, Activity-wise, um, you know, ultimately when the patient was finished with a reconstruction process, which may take up to 12 months, that they hopefully can resume their natural and normal life and their normal activities. I have patients that are competitive sailors, that are competitive horseback riders, swimmers, and they all seem ultimately to get back to their, their activities after about, a, after about a year, typically.